AG Tools Plugin for Autodesk Revit Video Manual Part 1, How to Install. Now the installation is very simple, I'm going to guide you through it. So first you go to www.letsbintogether.com. You can find the link in the YouTube video description. When the web page loads, you're going to click download. And then you're going to click, click here to download the latest AG Tool version. Now this will bring you to my Google Drive. To download the zip file, you just click this little icon right here. Google will scan for viruses, it'll take a second, and the file itself is very small. So let's go to our downloads folder, and here we have a zip file. We just need to extract the contents. I like to use 7-zip, extract here. And here we have an installation file, uninstaller, and a read. Now in the future, if you ever want to uninstall this, one option is to right click the uninstaller, run as administrator, or you can actually just use the Windows Add or Remove programs. I just have two ways of doing it in case one doesn't work. So let's go ahead and install this. Now your screen will go black for a second, and it's just Windows asking me if I want to run the installer. So here we go. I clicked yes. We're going to read through the agreement. Accept. Next. Install. And that's it. So let's go see uh, our plugin in Revit and fire it up. Okay, so now we get a message. Um, this signed add-in has been found. What would you like to do? This only happens the first time you run the plugin. Basically, Revit notices there's a new plugin and it's asking you if you authorize this. Once you click Always Load, it'll never ask you again. So let's go do that. And let's check out our ribbon. As we see, there's a new tab. AG Tools, and here's our tool set. And that's it guys, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next part.